Wilson with Team Wilson Real Estate Partners. Wanted to come to you today with your Tuesday tip and walk through the difference between being smart and studious. Now, which do you choose or which do you consider yourself to be, smart or studious? Myself, I've always considered myself to be a studious person, not so much a smart person. And I am definitely perfectly fine with that because here's a couple of things I would just want to share with you. When I decide there's something that I need to know, I commit to learning it and I won't stop until I do. Do you do that? Because while there may be somewhat of a genetic limiter on how truly smart you are, the only limiter on how studious you are is yourself. Which that would kind of bring me to the first part of how I've become smart during my search for being studious and how you can do the same thing too. And while it sounds simple, it's a huge practical implication in your life. There's definitely indicators along the way that will help you through this process. So here's how you can take your studiousness and become smart. You spend more time learning. You probably think about that's your big idea. What? Will you spend more time learning before you X out this post before you X out my Tuesday tip? I want you to look at a couple things for me. Maybe you decided a long time ago that you weren't smart and a decision to believe that you're not smart is much more harmful in your life than actually being smart. If you or someone you know has made that decision based upon just a random thing or random happening or something that someone has said to you, I'm going to challenge you to immediately explode that belief because the truth of the matter is, is that we all can become smart if we choose to be studious in our life and simply learning each and every day and taking the things that we desire to learn and apply those and take every ounce of knowledge that you can get in those areas and grow from it and uh, execute those areas in your life. I really, really hope to see you guys um, in the near future, either at a happy hour or hopefully at one of our open houses or a ribbon cuttings, which you all should all be aware of. Um, once again, we come and I bring these Tuesday tips to you for no other reason than to just share a little bit of my life with you guys.